Hello, today we'll be resetting the adaptive cruise control system and the forward collision warning system on this 2016 Nissan Altima. First though, we have to do the alignment and the steering angle sensor reset, so let's get to it. Now that we've completed the alignment and the steering angle sensor reset on this vehicle, all that's left is resetting the optional adaptive cruise control and forward collision warning. Uh, we'll use the CodeLink device to perform that along with a Nissan radar aiming fixture that you'll see in just a moment. We'll follow the on-screen instructions. Once communication is established with the vehicle, we must locate the radar behind the bumper and place the fixture directly in front of it as specified on screen. The wheel clamp, stand, and laser assembly are used to place the fixture perpendicular to the vehicle's thrust line. For detailed instructions on how to perform this setup, please refer to Hunter's Learning Channel on YouTube and search for ICC Setup. The radar's position is calculated by placing the fixture at three different angles. So now that we went through the steps with the fixture, the vehicle has communicated the adjustment required for the radar device itself. We'll make that adjustment using this T-handle Allen wrench uh, through an access panel in the bottom of the vehicle's bumper. So we'll do that right now. It's 0 .31 degree, uh, turns counterclockwise. So now that the adjustment's complete, we'll use the fixture to verify our adjustment. It'll take just a moment. So as we can see, this screen says that no vertical adjustment is necessary, which means we can move on with the procedure. So now we've reset the adaptive cruise control and forward collision warning system on this 2016 Nissan Altima. Most Nissan and Infiniti vehicles equipped with ACC or FCW use the same fixture and procedure as you've seen here today. Thank you for your time.